it's your favorite YouTube dealer. I appreciate you guys for stopping in. We're going to dive into something out the UK today. Nines, Tony Soprano 3. I'm pretty sure I did a reaction to the last two. But I can't find them. So they might have been on my main channel where I privated all my music reactions. Regardless, I am familiar with Nines. I've heard a couple of songs from him. I think he's pretty dope. And I like checking out people from the UK. So give me some more suggestions down below. But let's dive into this. Let's see what he's cooking with. Like, what do you think about Nines retiring? I'm sad. I can't talk about it. It makes me emotional. As a loyal Nines fan, kind of bad. young, it's heartbreaking. So death of the end of the era. I can't lie. Death of the end of the era. But... That can't be true. That can't be true. Are you being serious? Yes. It don't make sense. I can't retire from music. It's a cool. It's a joke thing, to be honest. I'm pissed. But at the same time, he's done what he's needed to do. That if they're calling this a game, you could say that he's conquered it. There ain't nothing that he ain't done. Nino, I'm big and bad. One to them, I'm my boss. Nino. Let's go. One to them, Nino. I just like the best kept secret in black music. You don't realize how big Nina is until you really realize. If you don't know, I'm going to I'm going number 20 on the belly W like it's like it's not. I'm talking about. You know what I mean? Last album, it's gonna be bangers on there, crazy for the Soprano free. I know it's crazy. I, I had half a London high. With, with this kind of yay, the fiends touch the sky. Zeno died, I had to move like a boss. Smash my chain, it could pay for your funeral cause. Funeral cause. These, these bitches made me want to change number. I, I, he said, snatch my chain, it could pay for your funeral cause. Yo, that's actually fire. Basically saying, you snatch my chain, you're going to end up in a funeral. And at least the chain will pay for it, I guess, at the very least. But that's the thing that I say to a lot of people that, that you know, you see these rappers, they get really big, and then they go back to, to their hood. And I, and I do quotes because some of them, pretend to be from a hood and they just go play, you know what I mean? But then some of them actually are, right? But regardless, you go back there and you got on a $50,000 chain, $100,000 chain. You got money in your pocket. You're driving a fancy car. As much as you may have had so much respect back there, and, and there's times where you're going to continue to keep that respect or you got enough connections where people ain't going to mess with you because they don't want anything to happen to them or their family. But there's going to be people that are going to see you that maybe respected you in the past and wouldn't mess with you. But now they're like, yo, I got to figure out how to get food on my table next week. And you walking around with a hundred thousand dollar chain, I could take that pawn that shit for like half that or less, and, and change my life. So they're willing to crash out for that chain. So it's just like you got to be very careful once you get that money and shit. Pay for your funeral cause, funeral cause. These, these bitches made me wanna change number. I had zips in the hood like a big jumper. Last, last night the gang chilled. I drank so much I had a Liverpool like Anfield. Anfield. He says he's getting dope, but I'm not sure. You see that nigga's chains, I got golf clubs that cost more. Me and, me and my nigga Carlos in the lab. Go, go, go hard or go yard like my bitch is back. Yo, people gonna stop jacking chains. They gonna start looking for golf clubs then. Yeah, my nigga Carlos in the lab. Go, go, go hard or go yard like my bitch is back. I, I, I thought she would never lie till she changed on me like a Gemini. They rob, they rob hell more, of course they'll rob me if they... Hey, yo, listen. Yo, come on now. I feel like Geminis stay getting a lot of shade. Clearly, I'm a Gemini. That's why I'm defending them. I'm not like an astrological, astrology type, whatever. I'm not really into all of that. But I know that when I meet someone who is, mostly, you know, females, they be shitting on Geminis. Like, oh, you're a Gemini. I got to be careful. with. It's like, what you mean, bitch? Like, I'm, there ain't nothing wrong with me. There's something wrong with you for thinking that. Never lie until she changed on me like a Gemini. They rub hell more. Of course, they rub me if they could. And they wonder why I hardly be in the hood. Let's go. Let's go. Smart. Even on the Smart. school run, I got my ting. M miss my daughter's first birthday. I was on the wing. And it was only for a year and it still aged me. I, I got niggas doing fair. It must feel crazy. Big, big four fizzy on me. Pray I don't get Stop my niggas girl left before he hopped off the sweat box. I, I went fashion week and I bought a plus three. I went, I went and sell those clothes, it was just me. I see mad losses. Now the mansion's so big, I need free tag boxes. When, when every label was trying to sign me, I had every plug in the country trying to find me. Find me. I'm the worker, the plug, and the middle man. Had that nigga got a nine to five, who's a little man? When we out in DBX, some hoes get excited. I, I just pray none of my niggas get extradited. I'm, I'm trying to decide should, should I cop the rainbow down put my pride to the side I wanted to be like BMF I turned into me still on my grind now I just work from a beach with yo that's dope wanted to be like BMF Meech and so, so it's, it's dope that there's some inspiration and shit like that from from things that are more you know American based and stuff but what he said a while ago I don't want to I've been pausing it a lot so I don't want to pause it again but he said 
that's why I normally don't be in the hood or something like that. So I, basically, he don't spend a lot of time in the hood anymore. And that's smart because that goes back to the exact thing that I said in the beginning is, is like you can have the respect of everybody in your hood. But as soon as you start coming around with $100,000 chains, so on and so forth, eventually there's going to be for some people that poverty overtakes that respect. And, and they just gonna do what they gotta do to try to change their life and give themselves that leg up. I'm trying to decide, should, should I cop the rainbow dial, put my pride to the side, I want it to be like BMF, I turned into meat, still on my grind now, I just work from a beach, we'll call you, don't call us, you don't, you don't get pussy roll with me, I made my whole tour bus, I don't care about a whole ceiling, went, went back to the hood, I ain't used to the low ceilings, uh, uh, CSB, CS, we the actual mo, trying try, try to get these billions, I like Axel Rod, these niggas ain't plugs, they got expensive prices. Had to pay the governor, he tried to send me ISIS in the kitchen, whipping up a potion. My, my lighthouse ain't in the middle of the ocean, nigga. She crossed the line. My, my nigga caught his girl cheating, and they ain't leave, fam. He lost his mind. And lying on the gram about watches, they can't afford. You got too much time on your hands, huh? I, I always knew you was a hater. Fam, fam you ain't a hater, cause you had the range shooting at some paper. I'm, I'm the blueprint like Jay-Z. I, I ain't fucked her forever, and she still Trying to claim me, the streets are crazy. There's no telling who would die next. And my youngest shot for a blender and a Pyrex. I, I just had to set a plan. I just wanted Daniel or Keisha and a TT like Mega Man. All, all these grown men gossiping. They don't want to see me in the field. My stop like Usher Man. Bro, I like this. First of all, as far as the technical raps, I ain't really spoke on that. I like it. It's a smooth, kind of laid back, just vibe type shit, but he's saying some stuff. I like the voice, the the just the, the lyrics, but he said like I like all of it. See, there's no telling who would die next. And my young is shot for a blender and a pyrex. I, I just had to set a plan. I just wanted Daniel or Keisha and a TT like Mega Man. All, all these grown men gossiping, they don't wanna see me in the field. My stop like Usher Man. I'm still here, I seen the rest fall. My, ch my chicks bum soft, I just squeeze it like a stress ball. Fly, fly my girl <laughs> in, he like let's roam prop. Yo, that's mad funny because I remember a girl that I, I'd hang out with. In in the past she i don't think she watches these videos but just in case by chance she does shout out to sam um she had a monstrous like yo bro her ass was, was yo she had a huge ass i'm all over the place like i mean i've been with girls with huge asses and, and thicker i've been with girls that are extremely tiny like 90 95 pounds my taste and i like all the flavors but we would like just be chilling and it's like a stress ball it really is like you just be sitting there and it's just like you start rubbing and squeezing on some cheeks and it just like everything just whew, like a nice release of just energy. It, just feel, it feels real. Listen, I, I get what he's saying. That's all I'm saying. I get what he's saying. Crop circle chain glowing like it's fresh home. Fresh home. Free, free my nigga Jazzy. That's my family. I'm posted free Palestine. They shadow ban me. It's nice. It's nice. It's the end of the era. He's definitely the goal. He said he posted free Palestine and they shadow ban me. That's the thing with a lot of these different platforms is like sometimes they just try to avoid the conflict stuff altogether. So regardless of what side you fall on, they're going to shadow ban it. They just don't want it to be a part of their platform in a, in a major scale. They don't want people to start to take off and it be the main thing talked about, shared, so on and so forth. And then there's other times where platformers will, will have a side that they've picked themselves. And if you post something about the other side, they're going to shadow ban you. Because at the end of the day, you got to think like it's people, right? Like as much as people should just run their business is logically as possible as unbiased as possible and allow you know as far as like instagram twitter all that stuff there's going to be people that are in charge and in places of power that have a specific view themselves and if things seem to be on the other side of that view and they feel very strongly about it i feel like that kind of shit can happen 100 percent. so you got to be careful out there but shout out to, to nines i like this let me know what you guys thought if there's more stuff we should check out is the stuff in the beginning like we said oh nines retired and was that just like showing that people were talking about it or thinking that maybe he retired, but he's like, boom, I'm back? Or is this like his last project that he's going to be coming out with and then he's stepping away? Somebody let me know, but take it easy. Stay safe. I'll catch you in the next one, homies.